continue to continue with the same chapter fractions here as we're going to learn about a new subtopic and that subtopic's name is adding and subtracting fractions so now let us about topic so now let us learn how to add and subtract like fractions so if you want to add or subtract the like fractions we first will have what you have to do is that you have to add or subtract the numerator and keep the same denominator which will be the like fraction 2 by 5 plus 3 by 5 is equal to 2 plus 3 by 5 that is the correct way to add like fractions so for example if you want to add 3 by 7 and 2 by 7 we need to just add them 3 by 7 plus 2 by 7 is equal to 3 plus 2 by 7 which is equal to 5 by 7 uh, if we want to subtract we can subtract 2 by 7 from 3 by 7 it will become 3 by 7 minus 2 by 7 which is equal to 3 minus 2 by 7 which is equal to 1 by 7 so how do we add or subtract unlike fractions to add or subtract unlike fractions we have to find the LCM of the denominators of the given fraction and then we have to multiply the numerator and the denominator of each fraction by a number such that each denominator becomes equal to the LCM. 2 by 7 plus 1 by 3 it will not be equal to 2 plus 1 and by 7 by 3. It will not be like that. It will be 6 plus 7 in by 21 we'll just take the lcm of 7 and 3 which is 21 we'll multiply 2 into 3 6 and, and 1 into 7 which is 7 so it'll be 6 plus 7 which is equal to 13 so the answer of 2 by 7 plus 1 by 3 is equal to 13 by 21 so now let us check some examples on how to add and subtract unlike fractions so to add like unlike fractions our example will be 1 by 2 plus 1 by 6. So, in this, we have to notice that the denominators are different. 2 and 6, they are different. So, our step 1 will be to, since the denominators are different, we must rewrite the fractions uh, so that the both fractions have the same denominator. So, in shorter words, we must find the LCM of 2 and 6. So, the LCM of 2 and 6 is equal to 6. Now, what do you have to do? Yes. Now, you have to multiply the numerator and the denominator of each fraction. Sorry, what is 6 divided by 2? Yes, it is equal to 3. So, it will become 1 by 2 into 3 by 3 which is equal to 3 by 6 and 1 by 6 will not change as the denominator 1 by 6 which is 6 is already this LCM of the number so it will become 3 by 6 plus 1 by 6 3 by 1 3 plus 1 is equal to 4 so it will become 4 by 6 therefore 1 by 2 plus 1 by 6 is equal to 4 by 6 now, let us find out the example for subtraction of unlike fraction. So, our example is to subtract 3 by 8 from 5 by 12. So, first we'll have to find out the LCM of the denominators, which is 8. The denominators are 8 and 12. So, the LCM of 8 and 12 is equal to 24. So, 3 by 8 will be equal to 3 into 3 plus by 8 into 3 which is equal to 9 by 24 and for 5 by 12 it will become 5 into 2 by 12 into 2 which is equal to 10 by 24 now we have to subtract 9 by 24 and 10 by 24 which is equal to 10 by 24 minus 9 by 24 and what is 10 minus 9 yes that is equal to 1. F4. 5 by 12 minus 3 by 8 is equal to 1 by 24. Now, what if we want to add or subtract the fractions which have their co-prime numbers as their denominators? Let's 
first resort to an example first. So which is 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2. Now you have to notice that the denominator which is 2 and 3, they are co-prime numbers. So the LCM will of 2 and 3 will be 6. So it will become 1 into 3 by 2 into 3 plus 1 into 2 by 2, 3 into 2, which is equal to 3 by 6 plus 2 by 6. So that is equal to 5 by 6. Therefore, 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 is equal to 5 by 6. Now let us use for subtraction. Our example will be 7 by 8 minus 11 by 15. So our LCM of 8 and 15 will be 120. So it will become 7 by 15 by 8 into 15 minus 11 into 8 by 8, 15 into 8 which is equal to 105 by 2, 120 minus 88 by 120. 105 minus 88 is equal to 17. So therefore 17 by 120 is equal to 7 by 8 minus 11 by 15. Now what if you want to add or subtract fractions which has one denominator is the multiple of the second denominator? addition will choose 1 by 2 plus 1 by 4. Notice that 2 is a multiple of the denominator 1 by 4 which is 4. That means 2 is a multiple of 4. The LCM of 2 and 4 will be 4 so it will become 1 into 2 by 2 into 2 plus 1 by 4 which is 2 by 4 into 1 by 4. That will become 3 by 4. Therefore 1 by 2 plus 1 by 4 is equal to 3 by 4. Now let us use for subtraction. For subtraction, we'll take 59 by 60 minus 15 by 30. The LCM of 60 and 30 will be 60. So it'll become 59 by 60 minus 15 into 2 by 30 into 2, which is equal to 59 by 60 minus 30 by 60. 59 minus 30 is equal to 29. Therefore, 29 by 60 is equal to 59 by 60 minus 15 by 30. Now let us learn how to add and subtract two mixed fractions. There are two ways to add and subtract mixed fractions. So this is the first way and in the next slide we will learn about the next way. So the question is 7 3 by 5 minus 4 5 by 6 plus 3 2 by 2. So firstly we have to solve the whole part first which is 7 minus 4 is equal to 3 and 3 plus 3 is equal to 6. So that we in the end we will put a I part because we'll need it later. Then we'll have to sub solve the fraction part, which is 3 by 5 minus 5 by 6 plus 2 by 3. So the LCM of 5, 6, and 3 is equal to 30. So we'll convert 3 by 5 into 6 by 6 minus 5 by 6 into 5 by 5 plus 2 by 3 into 10 by 10, which is equal to 18 by 30 minus 25 by 30 plus 20 by 30 which is equal to 18 minus 25 plus 20 by 30. It will become 13 by 30. And at the end, now we'll have to combine the I part and the II part. So the I part is 6 and the II part is 13 by 30, which is equal to 6 13 by 30. Now let us learn about the second way. It will be the same question. So firstly, we'll have to convert the mix to improv fraction. Which is equal to 5 into 7 plus 3 by 5 minus 6 into 4 by plus 5 by 6 plus 3 into 3 by 2 by 3, which is equal to 38 by 5 minus 29 by 6 plus 11 by 3. The LCM of 5, 6, and 3 is equal to 30. So 38 by 5 into 6 by 6 minus 29 by 5 into 5 by 5 and 11 by 3 into 10 by 10. It will become 228 by 30 minus 145 by 30 plus 1110 by 30. It will become 22 by 8 minus 145 plus 110 by 30. So that will become 193 by 30. So the answer of this question will be 193 by 30 or 6 13 by 30. So what did we learn today? We learn how to add and subtract like and unlike fractions, how to add and subtract fractions with co-prime numbers as denominators and fractions with one denominator as a multiple of the second denominator and adding and subtracting mixed fractions in two different ways. 
So if you guys like the video, please like, share, subscribe and hit on notification bell to get more notifications and upload more videos. Thank you and have a nice day.